one's called Speedy Pushers and it's especially for early years. The pupils must stand three metres apart behind a line, push the ball along the floor to a partner who stops the ball with the palm of their hand and pushes it back. How many pushes and stops can their pair do in one minute? Keep trying to see if the pair can beat their best score. Results will be recorded on the score sheet. This one's called Speedy Pushes 2, especially for Key Stage 1. The pupils must stand 5 metres apart behind a line, push the ball along the floor to a partner with a racket. The partner then stops the ball with the racket and pushes it back. How many pushes and stops can the pair do in one minute? Keep trying to see if the pair can beat their best score. Results to be recorded on the score sheet. This activity is called Speedy Catches and is for early years and key stage one. The pupils stand opposite their partner who is holding a tennis ball with their arms outstretched. The pupil that's holding the ball drops it and their partner attempts to catch it after one bounce. How many times can this be done successfully in one minute? This is Speedy Catches Key Stage 2. This is for Key Stage 2 children. The pupils stand opposite their partners, each of them holding a the tennis ball with their arms outstretched. At the same time, both pupils drop the ball and attempt to catch their partner's ball after one bounce. How many times can you do this successfully in one minute? This activity is called Activity Overview. It is for uh, early years and key stage one. This is a pair's task. Pairs stand approximately five metres apart. The large punch ball is bounced in between two players. The partners must try to keep the rally going by hitting the ball backwards and forwards with the palm of their hands. How many can they get in a continuous rally in the one minute time period? This is softball rallies with a racket. Aim for key stage two. This is a pair's task. Pairs stand approximately five metres apart. The sponge ball is bounced in between two players. The partners must try to keep the rally going by hitting the ball backwards and forwards with their rackets. How many can, get, can they get in a continuous rally in the one minute time period? shufflers and is for key stage two. People stand opposite their partner each with a tennis racket. Send the ball to the partner with one off, with one bounce. Partners return the ball with one bounce. The task is more difficult than the last rally as partners must also move up and down the court from the net to the baseline and back by shuffling to the side whilst returning the ball. <laughs> 